I don't know what relevance. You can't even see what we're doing. Stupid dinosaur. I'm so sick of men like him. You mean men like Barry. You say, hey, let's turn left. And he goes right, just so he can feel like he knows better. Yeah. My big brother was like that growing up, too. Chris? I up that one time and... Oh, I didn't need his help to feel bad. How is that guy anything like Barry? Capacity level three, you know what I'm putting this on. Yeah. Where was capacity level two? I guess I just missed it. Okay, so... These two handguns, 150, 136. And it's faster too, and it has higher capacity. So it's better in every way than the MPM. Yeah, okay, listen. Yeah, it's better in every way. So, uh, that, and I feel like that. Yeah. 190? Oh my god, it's way better! It's almost double damage! And firing rate is even now with the firing rate upgrade. Okay, so, gotcha. So it's supposed to be slower, but with mods, it's... It's just as fast. There you go. Anything over here? How much you look? Oh, there's a tower emblem. We gotta get it. Can't go move on without it. They sound so heavy when they break. It's weird. All right, so no handgun ammo, inexplicably. How much do we got? Four? Five! I love it! I'll take that. Got a sewers map. Feeling pretty good. What? Thought that was like an enemy we had to shoot. I was about to get really upset. We had to shoot bugs. It's not good. Alright, uh, let's see. Oh, boom! Yeah, I think I'll take some, thank you. And that's it. Alright. This is as fast as we can move through these, uh, this sewer water. What? Okay. It's gotta be some underwater creature thing here, right? Appreciate it. Moira, get up here. Quit dicking around. God. I mean, how do I do it? Get up here. Hey, more shotgun rounds. That's what I like. Are you okay? Did you get hit or did you just groan like that for no reason? Dude, we could totally go in there. That's really easy. If you want to, it might be cool. We could like build a fort or something. What do you think? Oh man. Do I have like resting bitch face? Jesus Christ, you fucking kidding me. I guess that ball didn't do shit. Dude. Dude. <laughs> yeah, how convenient. Just step right on up. You would have won if you'd stayed at a distance, dumbass. Stupid. 
Yeah, just come right on up. Let me shotgun you in the face. Give me a break. Well, what is it? Oh, good. Good. I've still got plenty of ammo, too. This game is really fun to play. It really is. Here you go. Come on, Moira. Gonna wait for you to do your crowbar thing. Here, I'll be lookout. Ooh, can you jump across? Well, maybe I'll try this while you're doing that. What? What? Oh. Okay. Cool. So what do we do here? Um, nice. What? That was pretty elaborate for just a wooden box with some stuff in it. It wasn't like it wasn't like there was like a big item in there or anything. That's what I thought. Oh, okay. Let's uh, craft something cool, like a decoy bottle, a third one, you know. Yeah, she doesn't need to have any weapons, I'm fine with that. Ah, fine, she can have one. Just in case we get separated and she has to kill something to move on with her life. This way? What, where? Oh my god. Hey Claire. Somebody wants to see you. This handgun is great. I've got so much ammo for it now. Too. Super, super terrific. Probably a tower emblem in here somewhere, right? Eh. Okay, let's do it, I guess. Oh, so we can walk across. Gotcha. Who else? Are there more? Is that it? Oh, there's a big guy up there. Shot him in the butt. Shoot him in the butt a couple times. I'll teach him. Oh! What? What are you doing? What? Is there another one? I think we took them all out. I uh, didn't know that that bloater thing came up beside me. That was annoying. Anything back here? Any glinties or anything? Aha! Five handgun ammo, it's very important. Can't miss that. Alright, let's go. Sure. 
Although, Claire needs it. She doesn't have any. And she's the one that takes the damage. Tower emblem. I don't even know what those, like, earn you. I don't know if they earn you anything, actually. Hmm. Okay. I'll just go up here. Ah! Footprints. This is where Natalia went. What was that? She's got special footprints, man. Special glow in the dark footprints. What? All right. This is like Natalia's little hideout over here. And then her tarp got ripped down. I don't know. Ooh! What? Take that, Ruby. Since you wouldn't get it. Aha! <laughs> Thought you could hide from me, didn't you? Five rounds of handgun ammo. Where? Did you hear that, Claire? Sounds like something bad. Pants. You can have three. Oh. Found in lots of lots of glinties. It's truly appreciated. All right, who's down there? We can kill you, you know. Might want to reload before I go down there. That might be. Good thing to do. Okay. Lev, shotgun out. Moira? Better follow me. Come on! Don't keep your distance. My gosh. Or any more? You idiots. Oh, really? What? Yeah, that's right. Knife him a few times. I'll show him. Let's go. That's scary. That'll save us a lot of time if we fall off. And I would like to get this box right here, please. Nice. Totally good. Uh, we're good to go, I think. No, Moira, there's nothing over there. Come on. Don't get distracted. Keep your eyes on the prize, etc. What? What's going on? Can we not? So, are we just not supposed to go over that thing? It did creak. I think it's supposed to, I think it breaks. Oh, he just flew over there. Moira. Fine then.
All right. All right. I've... Can't see. I couldn't fucking see. So that's great. Moira, why didn't you use disinfect? Do you not have any disinfectant? It's okay if you don't. If you didn't have any disinfectant, I understand why you didn't heal me. However, if you did, let's inspect. Oh, look! Look at that! I could've used that! Could've used that, Moira! Why didn't you give it to me? Pretty strange, considering you had some. I was staying there for a full, like, three seconds, just like, well, I guess I'm fucking blind! This is great. Fucking Moira, man. Natalia gets on that shit right away. She even did it when I was against the drill guy. They're dead. Where the fuck is Moira? Jesus. Use your flashlight or something. You know, I'm so sick of people commenting too, like, you blame everything on Moira, but you're doing everything badly. It's like, she actually, she factually does not help. She, it, it, you're just bad. No, she factually does not help. Golly. I, you know what, I prefer Ashley from Resident Evil 4. And everyone, for some reason, everyone whines about Ashley, but then they get onto me for whining about Moira. I don't get it. Ashley's far better, because she sticks close to you, she stays behind you when you aim your gun, because you can shoot her. You can tell her to hide, like, she's much better than Moira. Oh my god, and Natalia is much better than Moira too. I don't know how, because it's like the exact same AI, right? Or it should be. Like, I don't understand why, anyway. People get really serious about these games, too. Like, when I complain about it, they think I'm seriously upset. You should all know that... I'm like... I'm like three-fourths kidding. I just think it's fun to be mad. It's it's funny. Like fake mad. I don't know. Some people are just really serious people and they take it the wrong way. Especially when you get mad at a game that they love. Then they get really protective. And all of a sudden, like, you know what? You just suck. I love this game. I mean, like, for a record, I like this game a lot. I really do. But... The partner AI is bad. Like, and I, it's not just me. I am an average player. If it's bad for the average player, then it's bad. You shouldn't have to be fucking pro for the partner AI not to fuck you over. Hey. Follow me. Please. Maybe later? And like that part when she, when the, everything was on fire and I was like, follow me, and she wouldn't. And I had to go press A on the door in order to teleport her over there. Come on. That's bad. Anyway, I'm done. I just, I don't know. I should be allowed to complain about things without getting shit on. It's like, sorry, the game's not perfect. I like a lot of things about it. The partner AI is not one of them, and it's not just my fault. We must have reached the tower by now, right? I think so. What's this? It looks like a grave. I think the tower is just above us. I, I would... hope we can still get the drop on her. You're if not gonna get. Up. You're not gonna get the drop on her. I don't know how to tell this to you. You're not gonna do it. <laughs> she knows where you are right now. She's just not talking to you because she can hear you saying, "Oh, we get the drop on her," so she's not saying anything. Oh God. 
Oh man, she thinks we died in that explosion. Why would you think that? Your bracelets are still active. I just don't get their train of thought here. So we're doing something with the graves? Okay, not sure what that did. Take this empty bottle. Wow, we can craft things now. Okay, I'm gonna craft some disinfectant. Is that alright? Is that okay? Ooh, look at this. One, one, one. Thank you so much. I think we're good with two tourniquets for now. Bleeding doesn't happen as often as blinding. <laughs> Look at Claire holding her hand over her face. It's so bright. This is apparently the brightest flashlight that has ever existed. So what do we do here? Can we translate these markings or something? A eulogy for my brethren. We followed Master Alex to this island of not gonna even try. Which she has codenamed number 46. Our efforts have brought prosperity to the island, but more than that, we have come to help the master achieve her goal of rebirth. You have performed splendidly in your tasks, even in your final task to provide the master with valuable data at the cost of your own lives. Oh man, sorry. We are bonded in our servitude to the master. I can see my colleagues and my friends. I will help the master to finish the work which we have all started. I promise that your sacrifices will not be in vain. May you rest in peace. I don't know why I made them into like a... Like a 20 year old blonde girl with Starbucks in her hand, but... That's what I did! Found you. Oh man, remember in Revelations 1? When you're like going as Jill through the ship? Right before you fight Boobzilla. And she goes like, found you. And it like echoes through the halls. That was a pretty creepy, that was probably the creepiest moment of that game. That game didn't have a whole lot of creepy moments, but I liked that part. All right, I guess we'll read the note. Hey, I'm gonna read you all over. Release our sworn comrades. If you wish to know the truth, swear your allegiance in order. Only then can you cast away your shackles of sin. To the first, you are always foolish, so you will have no grave. To the second, you shall bear your visage upon your back. To the third, you shall neighbor the fourth by three, but one row behind. To the fourth, you shall lose your head. Who do they think they are with all these puzzles? Who do they think they are? They're... I'm sorry, wait, 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 you're Resident Evil. You need to stop it with this puzzle shenanigans. You know? Another empty bottle. Craft something. Boom! Let's go, uh... Do something more fun than toying around with the graves in a dumb puzzle. Unless we have to. We probably have to. Hey, this looks a lot like... Where we were... When we started out. Okay. What are we doing here? Do we not have to do anything with the graves? I thought I thought it was clear that there was a puzzle back there. We're just hanging out here though. Can we move these? Cool, this is a gigantic area. It'll be easy to figure out what to do here. Alright. I don't see any glinties, so we'll just go up the stairs. I took a cursory glance to it. I didn't see it. Still no sign of your boyfriend. He's not my boyfriend. All right. Shit. Look, there's something I gotta tell you. I noticed something when Neil was with us. His bracelet never changed color. Yeah, I know. I mean, the living dead were coming at us from all directions. Mm -hmm. He must have been scared. No. No, no. There's no way. Got it? End of discussion. Shut up, Claire. Alright, for once I'm on Moira's side. You need to fucking cool it with this Neil guy, alright? Maybe he's not who you think he is. In fact, I'm like 100,000% sure that he's not. Look at all this cloth! Holy shit! Fine, we'll make some more of this stuff. Uh, yeah. 
Sure. That's a lot. I used up a, a an herb or two as well. I don't think you need this. Just pass it on over. We've got so many supplies, it's crazy. Wait, you don't need this. Bye. Here, pass all of them over, please. There's no way. Because when combat hits, we just switch to Claire. And it's been working so far. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> Give me that. Moira, you can't hold the ammo. I really hate this blood overlay that I'm having to deal with right now. Let's see what happens if we try to go through this door. What? Well, there's a workshop in here. This list. Neil had it at the party. Barton, Chavez, Redfield. It's got all our names on it. <sighs> he sold Tara safe out. <sighs> Claire, I'm really sorry. <sighs> hey, look. Isolated the best candy. Good work. Now it's your turn to fulfill your end of the... What did you... Well, you wanted an Ouroboros sample. Now you've got it. Lapdog. You don't know shit about me. I know you were Lansdale's puppet. When Veltro incited the Terra Grigia panic seven years ago, the FBC was pulling the strings. The old man went down. But he was smart enough to pass the torch before he did. You played me. Because you're an idiot. You thought you could create a new terrorist threat to justify the FBC. A monster like you could never understand. Claire? Are you crying? No. I'm... I'm just learning to see a little more clearly. 